Hello YouTube, this is the Creative Duelist here and I've been making Let's Creative since 2016 Welcome! Today I'm here, I'm here with my Cosmo deck profile Finally got all the cards ready, all assembled and ready to go So let's begin with the main deck So for the monsters of course, for my uh, ships I played double um, Cosmo Dark Eclipser The reason why I played two is because I do play the dark, the, the full force virus in this deck is really powerful, very potent when you get it off, and Dark Eclipse is just a good card. Again, he says no to traps, and it's just a powerful card. Of course, um, the fat ships can't be targeted by card effects, so that's pretty generic. Everyone should know that effect. Double Forerunner. Forerunner gives you life points at, uh, during your standby phase, um, which is pretty nice, and of course, it can't be targeted. And of course the one lonely Dark Destroyer. Dark Destroyer is just such a good card. Again, it's good for um, for pressure. It's really good when you want to push uh, for some damage. Really good. Okay, for the lesser ships, pretty much the only lesser ship we play is the Triple uh, Slippy or the Slip Rider. Pretty standard. Uh, Slip Rider is just there to, uh, just to pop the back row. And that's going to round up the whole ships. I'm going to go ahead and talk about the pilots. Uh, the pilots, triple tin can, Cosmo tin can is just so good, it's always good to go first with this deck, and of course go for the tin can play. A double straw man just to recur back the big fat ships that were banished. Uh, the one farm girl, two is just so unnecessary, um, it's just always good to play one farm girl, she's just not as good as she once was. So one farm girl, one, uh, one sort trooper, standard. One Wicked Witch, and of course the, the Cosmo Dark Lady. I've only got one. You can go ahead and play two Dark Ladies if you want to, but uh, the one works fine for me. And of course for the last of the monsters, I play two Hand Traps. I play um, the Effect Veiler. I don't have Ghost or Ash or any of that, but you can play, the, play those cards um, if you want. But anyway, let's go on to the spell, shall we? Triple Cosmo Town, Standard. Recur back banished resources and of course mulligan so um, just in case you make brick if you draw too many ships no pilots and also this is good your, if your opponent blows this up um, or I, I think do you get the effect also uh, oh cool it's generic so even if you blow it up uh, you get search so your opponent never wants to MST this or anything like that because they'll go minus and you go plus double layer of darkness for the draw power one for one for the tin can, terraforming to search out the Cosmo Town, uh, one monster reborn, Itali, Regeki, Dark Hole to um, nuke the board. This is really good. Um, if your opponent just has monsters turtling and you've got ships, you can just Dark Hole. They get nothing. You float. You bring out. Your you bring out more shit, and you fuck your opponent over that way. And of course, for my spicy tech, I play one limit removal. Because who doesn't like smacking your opponent with a 6k Dark Destroyer in the face? <laughs> uh, but yes, that's going to round up the spell lineup, folks. Traps. Triple triple Torrential Tribute, again, for the whole aspect. It nukes the field and you get you get pluses. You, you, uh, but you basically float. Triple Call the Haunted, just to recur back the ships. Um, really good, because... Um, tin can does dump your ships if you if your opponent doesn't choose them uh, Double Cosmo Joe to remove threats that you know just can't be targeted And of course the double full force virus for the whole trap lineup. So that's gonna round up the whole main deck extra deck is really small uh, the Pleiades package uh, the cyber the cyber package and of course on Volcosaurus extra deck is almost irrelevant. We never make extra deck unless um, there is the opportunity where we can just use two slippies um, if we want to neg we can just go for infinity if we want to bounce we pick Pallades or if we want to blow something up and inflict damage we go for Volk uh, Volcosaurus is really good um, otherwise we don't really need to play extra deck you can play more of a link um, 
variant. You can play some scapegoats and slap some more links in the extra, but I didn't feel it was necessary for my build. So anyway, folks, thank you all for watching. If you folks enjoyed this video, enjoy the video, um, please remember to leave a like. Comment down below. Feedback is always nice to hear. Tell me your thoughts down in the comment section. Um, it's always nice to hear feedback. It helps improve upon my decks. So yes, this is the Creative Duelist signing off. I shall see you in my next video. Take care, stay creative, and subscribe for further content.